Hello, we're Walter and we're going, to through, we're going through some paintings that have been framed and brought to us today. So this, this picture is a mid-Victorian watercolour of a Dutch scene. The original version of this picture by Meadows showed a white cliff here, which would have probably almost certainly been England, and Ambrose, uh, the year after the, the original painted by Meadows, Ambrose painted this and changed it to a windmill. So this is an English scene which has been ch changed and changed into Dutch, a Dutch scene. Um, and you have in both paintings, you have the floating barrel, the boy, the, the ironclad, the vessel in the distance, the, the, the gulls, the tender, the fishing boat, the foul weather and the, and the good weather coming through. So uh, it's, a, it's a, not a Mediterranean sea, it's a muddy, muddy green, the channels, it's an English channel sea, the French wouldn't call it English channel, they would call it La Marge. Um, and um, it's quite a wide panoramic picture. It's very well painted. It would, very, it would be very hard to paint it any better. The characters have got uh, uh, collars you can see, and there's objects in the, in the boat. The stitching on the sail is visible. The trees in the distance and the houses are wonderful. The smoke on the chimney is going that way. That has a corresponding uh, sail billowing from air that way you have got the um, steamer with steam coming out with the steam going the, the right way it's facing into the storm which a ship like that would do in bad weather and uh, there's a lot going on you've got you've got the fishermen you've got the lost barrel the shipping the storm the wind the choppy water and, and, the, and the sky with with the clouds so we had it. To, we had it. We bought it in a very ordinary frame, and it was somewhat anonymous. And um, when we took it out of the frame, we, we found this name on the back um, and this attribution, which we we, we uh, uh, tallied with the owner of the original, who we spoke to in England. Um, and the originals for sale in England for fourteen thousand pounds. And we can provide a picture of that original, which is very similar, as I say, apart from the, the alteration here. Um, we wanted to display it in a, in a useful way. People don't want drab English watercolours, but they do want pictures. And if this is in Malta, people would rather have a Maltese picture. But if that was a Maltese picture, it would be quite a lot of money. Because it's an English picture in the wrong place, it's in Malta, not in England, this will sell for a few hundred euros. And the buyer will, will get a cleanly framed, reasonably, reasonably sized, fine quality, uh, English watercolour with, with a backstory and a date and uh, we had it framed off the back onto, on, a, on a, a mount so it's called a floating mount and you can see the edge of the, of the, the whole piece of, of paper and we, we picked out the, the bronzy colours in the, in, in the sails and masts we put it in a bronzy frame we've picked out some of the browns and thought we'll put it on a, 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 a dark brown chocolate coloured mount so this is available in Malta for someone who wants a picture and um, we will provide a photograph of the back with the, this attribution on and we will find we will provide a, a photograph of the original for sale in England. Thanks very much.